This is Grain Kitchen Ware's uh, Julian uh, Vegetable Peeler. Uh, this particular peeler is pretty similar to one being sold under uh, different brand names. Uh, really, the only major difference with is just the, the logo, uh, which says Aminco. It's a little hard to see on camera there, but it says Aminco as opposed to other brand names uh, uh, be, this being sold under. So, uh, so in, in that case, this this is exactly the same, even down to the box that's provided here, which uh, seems to be kind of coming from the same manufacturer, even down to the the instructions on the back, which are pretty poorly translated uh, instructions into English. Uh, now, granted, instructions aren't really essential with this. The translation on the back does need some work and, and you know, maybe some customization to each particular brand that these are selling under. But uh, the peeler itself is stainless steel. Uh, it's lightweight. It's got a nice sturdy handle. It's well made. Uh, it appears to be pretty comfortable to use overall. It has the dual blade type, uh, similar again to other brands, uh, you know, for peeling and julienne style. The blades themselves are very sharp and peel well in a variety, with a variety of foods. I'm gonna, I've got an apple here, and granted, you don't normally, you don't normally do a peel an apple, but just to kind of demonstrate the blades, I kind of want to just show you kind of what it does there. There's one side, uh, and then there's the other more like peeling of the apple itself, but they're pretty sharp. The blades are sharp. They peel well. Uh, one of the particular blade sides, like this particular side here, is a little stiff in the in the slots, uh, but it still functions as it should. Um, it's just a little stiff to move around uh, as compared to others I've tried. That's just probably a manufacturing thing. Um, but I've tried to actually bend this and, and pull the blades out to test how well it holds up, and it's pretty strong. It didn't, the steel was strong, it didn't budge. Uh, but the one thing, like all of these similar manufactured uh, uh, peelers, is the tabs here are a little short, which concerned me a little bit. Uh, I kind of wish they were a little bit longer and kind of bent or turned to create a sturdier. Uh, you know, hold in that slot so they don't come popping out. I couldn't get them to pop out, so, I mean, they are holding up, at least for now. And it's a minor concern to me, uh, especially since uh, Grand Kitchenware, uh, who's selling these backseas with a no-hassle guarantee, which is good, too. But overall, I mean, I think this is a good quality peeler. Uh, it seems to be well-made, as long as you really ignore the fully translated, and you know, instructions on the box. Uh, this is a good quality peeler. I really only have the minor concern with the with the tabs on the blades, but otherwise this appears to be a pretty good quality and good sturdy uh, peeler and has a good warranty. I give this four and a half stars.